Samsung has rolled out a new version of its Samsung Internet Browser. This puts the application up to version 15. And while it is currently available in a beta, it can still be downloaded right now. And this version 15 will be rolling out to the stable branch in the near future. We're told this new update has introduced new features that mainly enhance the privacy of the end user while also protecting some user information. One of the ways version 15 of the Samsung Internet Browser does this is it protects the user against fingerprinting. If you're not familiar with, the, with what this is, fingerprinting is a technique that tracks the network use in an attempt to correlate information about the user. So even though you may not be able to specifically identify this person who uses a Samsung internet browser, a website is able to use software that can analyze all the things you have set up, such as the resolution, how many tabs open, etc., and then use that to narrow in who you actually are. And that's actually being prevented against in Samsung Internet 15.0. So not only that, but Samsung has also added some information to the way that you can remove stored data on your device. So it is, as it is right now, when you go into the settings application and you want to delete your browsing data, in version 14, you just get to select certain categories that you want to delete, and then you select delete. However, in version 15, when we go into the settings area, and then we go into personal data, followed by delete browsing data, you can see our page looks different. Not only are we able to select which categories we want to delete, but we're also told some information about that. For instance, if we deleted our cached images and files, we would clear up about 12 megabytes of storage. If we were to delete our cookies and site data, we would be removing this information from about 13 websites. Now, another change that's happening in version 15 of Samsung Internet Browser is secret mode once the once it is activated by the user it will the browser will remain in secret mode whenever you force close the app and open it back up as you may know secret mode is similar to incognito mode so whenever you turn it on it will keep your browse your browsing private and safe so before, whenever we started secret mode and we would close the application, in version 14, when we open it back up, we need to go into our app and turn on secret mode again. However, in version 15, you can see secret mode is on and it stays on even after you close and force close the app until you manually turn it off. Now to make browsing experience even more easier, version 15 of the Samsung Internet Browser will temporarily store websites you visit, kind of like a cache. So that whenever you go back to that website, you can quickly access that data without having to reload it from the server. And finally, the last new feature of this update is a new widget, specifically a search widget. That as you can see, it looks very similar to the Google search widget. that whenever you do a search, it's still going to use your default search engine. 
and it is even styled for the Samsung internet web browser. So that's the new features coming in version 15 of Samsung internet, which again, you can download and begin using immediately right now by installing the beta version, which is available in the Play Store or the Galaxy Store. However, all of these features will be coming down into the stable branch in the near future.